Hello everybody, welcome to the final of BBSL Season 2 in the final again. What a legend I am. Only joking, of course. Um, yeah, so here we go. We've got Ando Andy Devo in the final. He's got a block mighty wolf, which is pretty good use of his double. Uh, isn't it? And he's got four guards, which is very nice. Blodged up ghoul. Block wolf. He actually was missing a skill. He could have had like a blodge wolf to go with his block mighty, but... Um, he ended up not taking the skill, so this is weaker than it kind of should be. I think it's a very good build apart from that, though. Although it is, of course, only 11 players. If he gets unlucky with removals, this could go badly for him, but it hasn't yet, really. Um, up against my humans, loads of guard, uh, mighty blow tackler. Um, and, you know, it's, it's done pretty well, hasn't it? I uh, got very lucky in some games, but there you go. Uh, through at the final again, absolutely glorious. Fymir will take over so I can try hard, so thank you very much, Fymir. And see you Hello. later. Okay, everybody. I'm now at the wheel here of the comments. Don't forget, uh, Jimmy, to turn off the animations, just in case. And here we have a classic match. Andy versus uh, Jimmy. Jimmy versus Andy. The two of the most famous uh, Blue Ball coaches in the last few decades. Yeah, probably you can say decades. I mean, they've been... Uh, Similar that and the BBSL and, and a special edition of the BBSL final with uh, some kind of Paralympics edition because Jimmy hasn't been playing blue ball for a while so he's very rusty and Andy decided to not uh, pick one skill well, forgot to pick one skill so his team is missing a, one skill still is a really really good uh, necro team with all the tools in it probably maybe if there was another skill to add, man, could be, you know, maybe sure hands somewhere, or maybe a zombie with dirty player, just in case. But that 20 TV is not going to make a massive impact, I think. I think. And uh, for those that are new to the BBSL, uh, the format is one minute turns, resurrection format, so... If any player dies or whatever happens, you have them next game. There won't be a next game after this one because this is the final, but both teams are full roster for this game. Uh, Jimmy has uh, one uh, reserve and uh, Andy is going with 11 in uh, region he trusts. Only one uh, goal, optimizing to the top. I mean, after all the wars, are like ghouls but uh, angrier and um, most of the time more useful and let's see there you go I and the making a joke about the uh, surviving the knockout phase of a competition the first round he's uh, famous by not being able to pass the CCL Cup beyond the first round Absolutely weird and a statistics uh, miracle, I have to say, because he's a really, really good coach. And his teams in the Cali Chalice are always really, really, really good. But now this is the VSL. So here we go. And a rock in the face. Only a stand, so it's not as bad as it could be, but obviously... And now things to follow here is obviously it's going to be how the fleshes are going to behave. You know, they're going to be able to stay on their feet and stand firm, keep the guard in place. I don't think uh, Andy is going to fall in any frenzy trap with the uh, Wolves. He's uh, one of the best when it comes to frenzy players. Who should hands pop up there? And the armor breaks and the injuries. Both of them have uh, the Wolves. The Mighty Block Wolf is a real danger for the Jimmy's players, but the armor is well covered. And they have more or less the same, uh, they have exactly the same amount of guard for players. So here the game is going to be in the little details, time management, 
and uh, being able to handle the pressure of being in a one minute turns. There you go. The fact that the rock got there made it easier for the Andy to get this, and now he can put his play in a safe spot. But yeah, there wasn't a have been a a pow. That world would have been in trouble. Surprise it. And this is who is going to be trying to get, you know, the removal and at the same time protecting the mighty blow players. Jimmy going to one side, try to put some distance for at least a group of some few zombies and the fleshy. Which is the strong point that has uh, Jimmy a little movement advantage in his uh, general players, but the wolves are really, really fast. Now, preparing the turn. This is in one minute format. You have to watch the board and make a plan in a few seconds and go with it. No space for a doubt. Or oh, there's going to be some kind of a chain play. And today, one of the best chainers in the game, famous by his same place. And his love to surf. Trying to keep as many players. Oh, there goes the the ogre. Oh, very good position in there by uh, Andy. Is he even going to blitz? Yes, there is. He's going for a massive chain, I think. No need. Oh, lucky removal, Akio. Not the end of the wall. No need for the apple yet. It's just a line, man. Jimmy going for the exposed piece. That white with the guard, taking him out, will be absolutely glorious. Push. Jimmy establishing the dominance here, pushing the players away. No need to pow them. Wait, what? One die is there. Oh, block. This is killing the game. Two dice there. Oh, oh, that armor break. Beautiful. Now, and he has 50 seconds to think if he wants to stop it or not. There are uh, 
it's a chain in play if he doesn't need to choose to stand firm, but the chain play will also put one of his players, yes, in a decent range. The ball very well protected with uh, well, very well protected. Surrounded by the guard players. Yes, space cadet. Yes, yes. Jim is learning from the best. Ah, yeah, that puts the fleshy with the guard in the peak of it. Jesus Christ, what a mess. It's gonna expose. Ah, I thought he was gonna put the. Oh, the mighty blow wolf. There you go. Here's the pow. I mean, going for the ball was one of the options, but also doing this armor break, very nice. Also, I have to remember that Andy, was the biggest of, uh, objective here, biggest goal is avoid Jimmy to score, stop the scoring. And now two dice on the ball. Yeah, clearly Andy Davo can see the matrix. And now the ghoul can go and grab the ball and maybe... There you go, no rerolls used. GFI, path. Does he need to re-roll that? I'm not sure. He has three rolls. He can greet something. So it would be horrible if he decides to re-roll it. Okay, but the scatter is uh, really good. Oh, bonehead here. Still, he's gonna be able to hit. He is going for the goal. Oh, that's a reroll. Instant reroll. Another pull. Oh, very unfortunate. Where were all the powers he used? Clearly, he used all his powers in his game versus Crucifer in the semi final. Powder, okay, that's good. Oh, really, really good. One wall out. Massive uh, result there. Could have been better, could have been worse, but that's, I think, getting rid of a wolf is very, very good for Jimmy. Fuck me, I can't believe that fucking misclick. I don't know if it was, you know, the thing where the cards obscure them or I just made a fucking mistake but jesus christ just running out the ball carrier like that was not intended <laughs> all right okay what a fucking okay way i was I had a little, some suspicions about that what a fucking stupid thing to do like obviously you can't recover from there it's just i've just lost and i know i've lost on turn four and i've got to sit through another hour of this now you can't obviously do that versus Devo, so it's just definitely a loss well, there is still chances. There is chances. Many things can happen in, in 12 turns. There's a chance for him to win 2-0 or 1-0. <laughs> That's it. Or maybe 3-0 if he casts a few people, but it's fucked. It's over. Very, very sad. Very sad that I fucked it. 
Oh, oh come on, Jimmy. Everybody turn makes three. mistakes. You still can't recover from this. This, this is what's uh, shit about this, though. This is what shit you can't recover in football. You just can't. You, 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 you know, it's an hour and a half game. This is faster because it's, it's BBSL. But normally, it's a fucking hour and a half game or a two-hour game where if you make one mistake like that, you just, you've just fucked it and you've lost. And it's fucking bullshit, isn't it? Like, it makes it a hard fucking game to enjoy when you get so fucking punished. For like one lap and like it was terrible i mean to be fair it was fucking terrible i can't recover flicky look at the board <laughs> look at the fucking board <laughs> i can't recover i've lost the focus i mean i'm not unfocused it's not like i'm gonna stop trying but i've obviously lost <laughs> Here comes the star of the surfing. Keo. Got one. Oh. Now, I think not tagging the ogre with any piece is what's going to give uh, Jimmy a chance here. Getting the ogre there. He has to roll that. It's too good. Oh, one in nine. Oh, Cass. GG, turn five. Into dead. No, choose dead. No. That was a mistake. Now he has an extra player. And uh, well, yes, the ladies and gentlemen, this doesn't look good at all. Feels good to be right. But yeah, I shouldn't have given him a reserve there, should I? I was like, oh, it doesn't matter, it's res. Oh, fuck it. Made it worse for myself for that. But it's over. I, I've got, I just want to concede. I've got no desire to finish this. Congrats, mate. Jimmy, are you sure you went to... Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. You know, I know this is my league and everything, but it's over. There's no point. There's no point. He's won. Um, right. You know, I, just, I threw the match. I threw the match with that fucking... Mo like, you know, I misclicked on my ball carrying it, lost me the match. That's it. There's just no point carrying on. So there you go. I mean, well done for him. He, he, he won, didn't he? He won fair and square. I just saved an hour of my life playing a shitty, boring game that I hate. So there you go. Um, thank you very much, Faimi. Absolutely brilliant of you to come on and do the do the stuff. Um, all right, there was. I have to say that was a quick one. It was, so, wasn't yeah. it? It was all right. I, I, you know, this one wasn't even a dicing. This was just me being shit. So that's that's fair enough. Uh, I, I I like this game a lot more than the one against PC. Uh, though I, you know, I felt like I'd have lost the final against PC anyway. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.